Well, on April 15th, 1997, a Marshall County 17 year old skipped school to go fishing in Little Cateco Creek near Pleasant Valley Road in Eagle Rock Drive outside of Arab. Instead, he found a man's body missing a head, hands, feet, and several organs. Now this is News 19 video from that day. The Marshall County Sheriff's Office immediately responded to the scene and began an investigation, trying to figure out who the man was, who killed him, and how he ended up on that creek bank. More than 26 years have passed with very few answers. Today, the Marshall County Sheriff's Office says it has identified the body. News 19's Emily Mosner joins us now live in Marshall County. And Emily, what do we now know? Well, today, Marshall County Sheriff Phil Sims identified the man as 24 year old Jeffrey Douglas Kimsey. Now, the sheriff's office tells us that he was originally from Santa Barbara, California, and they still aren't sure what brought him here to Marshall County, Alabama. Now, I want you to take a look at these pictures on your screen. They're, these are yearbook photos of Kimsey from 1993, 1994, and 1995 from his high school in California. You can also see the image that was generated by, in 2019 by Parabon. On, the company that helped tie together this investigation by analyzing the DNA. Now, investigators say DNA and new DNA technology are, brought, are what brought new life into this cold case that went cold years ago. Sheriff Phil Sims says he's happy to bring a name and some closure to Kimsey's family. However, his death is still unsolved, but they do believe new DNA technology will help find the perpetrator. We have evidence now from the scene that we're looking at for possible DNA matches for potential suspects. So we'll be working with Parabon and our forensic science for state on that aspect. And also I'm happy to announce today that we do have persons of interest in this case. And we will be active, we will be investigating those angles Sheriff Sims did not give any further details on the persons of interest. Now, Kimsey's body was found in the woods with his head, hands, and feet removed from his body. Investigators tell me they never found those body parts. One investigator who worked on the case for more than 15 years told me that whoever is responsible for that kind of crime must be a, quote, special kind of wicked person. Now, investigators tell me that his body, finding his body was a bit of a surprise because there was never a missing person's report report filed on him. They tell us that they believe he may have had a strained relationship with his family members or they thought he was just living somewhere else. Now there's still a lot of new details in this case and we're continuing to bring them to you coming up on News 19 at 5. But for now, live in Marshall County, Emily Moser, News 19.